In this video we're going to talk about narrowing a deer head. If we take a look at this photo here, you can see how the outside of the antler burr and the outside of the eye, they're lined up pretty, pretty much even here. As we look at this mannequin here, we'll put an eye in here. You can just see how far out this out of the eye lid sticks compared to the antler burr. So we're going to end up having to narrow this head out to make it fit. What we're going to end up doing, we're just going to cut this head off here. And then we're going to end up marking a little bit out here. We'll mark it up kind of a pie shape from the tip of the nose back. And we'll end up cutting this section out here in the middle and then it'll it'll squeeze in a little bit narrower. When we're cutting it here we want to try to keep it pretty center. We want to cut pretty much through the center of the bottom as we cut through the center of the top. I mean we could take it through a bandsaw or something like that and you'd probably be a little a little more of a straight line but I'm using the saw saw here for this. Now we have that wedge out and you can see just how much it's come in from taking that wedge out. Uh, we're going to use Gorilla Glue to bond this thing back together. I mean I use Gorilla Glue a lot for these type of repairs. Yeah this is just a pretty simple repair but it's definitely a necessary alteration on some deer. A lot of the deer that I mount they seem to have more of a slim head so I do this on a few of them. This particular deer was a young kid's first buck. And it's just a little four point, but he was pretty tickled with him. Once we get this head attached back on and the glue all set, we'll end up just rasping the form down just so that it meets up here with the head again. And you can see just how much closer that going that brought it. Now I'll probably still drill these eyes out just a little bit. And then rasp them some of the form around the eyes just to make it fit the way I want it to. Here's the completed deer. And you can just see how the outside of that antler burr and the outside of that eye is pretty well lined up here. That's all for this chapter. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the subscribe button. Thank you.